Okay, I can pretty much guarantee you, or at least promise you, you've never seen this creative client outreach method that I'm about to show you right now. It just happened as I woke up this morning unexpectedly. You wouldn't believe this, watch. So over here on Fiverr, I got a message by somebody named Vodka Kid. It says, can you help me with a project? I'm like, what project? They was like, uh, this will be about profit sharing. And since they use the word profit, I got interested because that's the name of my agency. So I thought it was a student trying to get at me. They said, would you be interested? I said, explain, please. Now, before I show you guys this next part, I just want you to know that uh, pretty much everything that I put on here is free. So it, it brings in a lot of agency leads for us and everything because what other pe people charge for, we give away for free just so we can cut out what you would consider competition and collaborate with people and make them partners. I strongly suggest you guys do that too in some way or another. But let me show you the message and, and, and the client outreach method, method, uh, method that they're using that's freaking crazy. Watch this. So the next message right after that was, we are seeking individuals who are interested in renting out their Upwork accounts for profit. So what is Upwork? I'm about to show you guys, just in case you've never seen it before. So why their method is so powerful, this is Upwork.com. Uh, it's similar to a Fiverr.com, guys, uh, where people can post jobs, but they can also come here to get uh, like work as well. Okay, so why is this so powerful? Powerful because the algorithms of Fiverr and uh, places like Fiverr and Upwork, they actually bring you prospects. They bring you leads. So if you pay attention to his message to me, you'll see it's nothing but leverage. He's trying to rent out other people's Upwork accounts. I'm going to go back over there to it in a minute and you'll see the genius. And the reason is, is Sometimes people don't even know how to get their accounts approved on Upwork. It gets suspended or they don't show it to anybody. You don't get any gigs. So he wants to rent out accounts that are already getting traffic, already getting requests, already getting jobs. But let me show you the plan. So he's willing to give you a little bit of profit just to rent it out, okay? And then guess what? You won't have to do the work. So as a software development company based in the U.S., we require Upwork accounts to secure projects and gain clients from the platform. We will utilize your Upwork profile to obtain projects, and you will receive your profit as follows. So a lot of people with the slave mindset might say, oh, well, you know what I'm saying? If I'm getting clients through my Upwork profile, why don't I just go ahead and, you know, do the project myself instead of sharing with them? Well, you got to look at it both ways. They're going to be renting out your profile from you. So you're going to be earning money whether like, uh, you know, client requests are coming in at all, like recurring income. And then when a client does request jobs or work from you, they're going to do the fulfillment. I mean, aren't you going to outsource the work anyway so that you're not going to be manually doing everything for the clients? Yeah, that's what bosses do. So basically you're getting paid by the fulfillment team. <laughs> you understand? So they're going to share whatever the client is paying with you. And you can track all of that because it's, tip, it's technically your account. So you'll know how much uh, they're making uh, off of the clients and everything. But they'll be doing all the work and probably doing whatever outreach and all of that stuff through your account, sending proposals and videos, all of that extra stuff. So why would they do this instead of just having their own account? Well, leverage, y'all. Like Upwork is difficult to get more than one account. It's difficult to get more than one profile. Like they'll ban you, it's, it's, it's all this stuff. So they're trying to scale up. They're trying to leverage you in order to get a massive amount of inbound leads and everything from qualified, interested companies. So I'm not the only one they're sending this message to. So just imagine if they get 10, 20 people to allow them to rent out the, their um, Upwork accounts. Right. And you can do this with other platforms, too, that like are algorithm based. Right. So they get 10, 20 different accounts that they're renting out and then they get, I will say, five to 10 projects per month. All right. And each of those projects are paying, um, you know, two to five thousand bucks. 
And then all they're doing is giving you, uh, you know, uh, I'll say 40% of that since they're going to be doing majority of the work. So that's like scale. That's crazy. That's awesome. And you're like, okay, well, can I just do that? Stop being in the can you business because you need to be leveraging other people's times, money, assets, efforts, skills, knowledge, all of that stuff. And that's what they're doing with you. They're trying to leverage your platform. And think about this. <laughs> when you create a profile, guys, you have experience. One of these guys have no experience, which is why they're not getting any client requests. OK, so now if they rent out, just pay to rent out your profile, they can leverage the fact that you have experience. You see what I'm saying? You have experience. So now when they're doing the uh, uh, proposals and everything, their profile, the, the client, potential client is going to be looking at the profile saying they got 10, 20 years of IT background or computer, this blah, blah, blah. Right. When they really don't have it, it's going to also show the projects that you worked on, but they're going to be using them. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? This is freaking genius. Y'all don't get it. If you ain't said nothing in the comments by now, you you just don't get it. So, you know, I, it's been a long time since I got, you know, excited by somebody's outreach method trying to uh, reverse market to me. Uh, but I'm definitely... <laughs> going to plug this into my affiliate network and have my affiliates using this technique. This is very smart, man. This is creative. Like, you know, uh, what do y'all think in the comments? So, you know, tell me, would you do something like this? Would you respond to something like this? Would you allow them to rent out your Upwork profile? That's what he's asking me. He said, hey, you know, you'll receive your profit as follows, you know, so you'll get you know, however much the project is paying, you'll get your cut from that, but they're going to do the work, meaning they're probably going to outsource it to, to somebody smaller. So you'll get the high, high price uh, jobs over on Upwork. They'll get paid and then they'll take their cut and go and get the fulfillment done, probably somewhere cheap, like on Fiverr or another platform like that, or somewhere in India or something. And voila, right? That's freaking crazy. So let me know what y'all think.